Since the dawn of Dillydale, the Mr. Men and Little Misses have looked to the heavens with wonder and awe. Or just plain nosiness. They've traveled to the farthest reaches of the galaxy in every type of rock imaginable. It takes great courage to travel into outer space, especially when your name is Mr. Bump and you've been sent on a very important mission. <laughs> um, so let me get this right, Miss Helpful. You want me to leave the safety of the spaceship and go out there to fix the satellite? Don't worry, Mr. Bump. This satellite repair will be easy as pie. But going into space is so dangerous. As long as you follow my directions, everything will be fine. Why don't I find that very comforting? Maybe because you need a tickle. <laughs> no, 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 okay, okay. I am outside the ship. It is very quiet. Tell us when you reach the satellite, Mr. Bump. Will do. Hey, this is pretty fun. Who knew I was such a good space swimmer? <laughs> uh, no! Uh, it's helpful. I'm at the satellite. Good work, Mr. Bump. Just let me find the right page. Oh, here it is. How to fix a satellite. <clears throat> Satellites are our robot friends. They are mostly dependable, but sometimes, like robot friends... I think you can skip that part, Miss Helpful. Just tell me what to do. Okay, what to do? How about have a tickle? No! <laughs> Control. What is your problem? Oh, thank goodness. So, oh, this is Mr. Bump. I was out here fixing the satellite when my fellow astronauts left me behind. Now I'm stranded in space. You are not stranded in space. Well, actually, I am. Ow! And now I'm being pelted by asteroids. Whoa! Big asteroids! Ow! Oh! You are mistaken. There are no asteroids in space. Over and out! Mr. Stubborn! Are you there? Oh, I should never have become an astronaut. Oh, whoa! Whoa! Boopity boop. Wah! Sorry about that, Mr. Boom. I must have hit the wrong switch. Oh, not to worry, Miss Helpful. Oh, I'm just glad you're here. You know what you need? To go back home to Dilly Dad? No, a tickle. No. <laughs> uh, don't tear my suit! With the decks on the dash I've got some rocket parts And a meteorite i got this Junker spaceship With a broken headlight If one person's junk Is another one's treasure Then the stuff I find In outer space brings double The pleasure It's intergalactic It's out of sight Like this rusty rocket Or the satellite If you travel deep into outer space, you may see some unusual things. Or hear something so mysterious, you must investigate at once. Like Mr. Stroll and his, uh, brave crew. Aw, oh, Pickles. You still hear it, Mr. Nervous? Oh, yes, Mr. Strong. 
hideous, horrible noises that can only mean one thing. Aliens! Will you two keep it down? I'm trying to play computer checkers. Sorry, Mr. Grumpy. I think we ought to go investigate. We have to find out what's making this noise. Yes, or leave the planet immediately. Oh, we can't do that. We're astronauts on a mission. Right, Mr. Grumpy? Oh, for noodles' sake, fine, I'll go. But let's hurry it up so I can get back to my checkers. Ugh. Oh, double pickles. No, oh, there it is again. I'm going back. Nah, I don't think that's aliens. That must be the aliens. It's coming from over there. Everyone set your lasers to stun and follow me. No, I'm pretty sure those aren't aliens. Oh, I just know they're going to get us. They'll probably keep me as their pet. <laughs> Must get away when I still can. Oh, don't worry, Mr. Nervous. I got you covered. No, it's definitely not aliens. Those aliens sure sound dangerous. No oh, dreadful doom! <laughs> Oh, crooked cucumbers! Be careful where you point that thing. Someone could get hurt. Ow. On the count of three, we're going in. One, two... No, 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 no! I won't let them take me alive! Say, I told you, it's not aliens. We're coming in, you aliens! Daredevil? Mr. Noisy? Hello there! I didn't know you fellas like ping pong! Well, actually, we thought you were aliens. Nah, my spaceship batteries needed to be recharged. So we thought we'd play a few games until it was ready to launch again. Well, if that's the case, I'm going back to the ship to finish my game of checkers. Well, uh, can we give you a lift back to Dillydale? No, thanks. My ship will be ready to go soon. Hey, how about you and Mr. Quiet join us for a game of doubles? Hey, now we're talking. Uh, when do I ever turn down a chance to play ping pong? Ha <laughs> ha! Super! It's a wonderful way to get the news every day. It's the Dilly Dale Morning News with Miss Naughty and Miss Scary. This is Miss Naughty with some late breaking news. Giant slimy monsters from outer space have landed in Dilly Dale. Witnesses say the aliens are stomping through the city, crushing everything in their path. They've even captured Miss Scary. So run! Get in your cars and get out of town. Oh no! The aliens have found their way into the newsroom! Go! Nah! Get, take your tentacles off me! It might be too late already. What is going on in here? Stop those cameras this instant! Not now, Mr. Fussy. We're doing the news! And for once, it's news worth watching! This is not news if it is completely false. Making up stories as a way to scare people is unacceptable. I thought it was fantastic! This thing looks totally scary! Ah! <laughs> Stop! Enough! I honestly don't know what is wrong with you two. Now, if you don't mind, read the real news. Let's continue. <laughs> I'm Miss Naughty. And I'm Miss Scary. And this is the news. Mr. Noisy has won this year's Dilly Dale Dance Contest. Ah! 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 Space Monsters! This time it's for real! I have had just about enough of this foolishness. And as for this fake foam rubber monster of yours, I... Duh! Ah! Oh! Good gracious! This hideous creature is real! 
Not to mention terrifying! It's fantastic! Ha <laughs> Miss Naughty! Miss Scary! Do something! <laughs> Those real space monsters were way scarier than our fake ones! I know! Wish for something long enough and it really can come true! <laughs> And so another day exploring outer space comes to an end in Dillydale. And what a day it's been. The Mr. Men and Little Misses know that outer space is full of surprises. Even still, they never miss a chance to rocket into outer space and brave the unknown.